classification using DNA or proteins. Organisms can be ranked in the taxonomic hierarchy based upon similarities and differences in their genes. The four main ways that genetic information is observed are DNA sequencing, DNA hybridization, comparison of amino acid sequences, and immunological comparisons. DNA sequences. Closer related organisms will have similar DNA coding than distantly related ones. In order to compare organisms' DNA, the sequence of the bases are analyzed. DNA hybridization is used to see how similar DNA is without sequencing it. DNA from two different species are collected. The DNA is then separated into single strands and then mixed together. Hydrogen bonds form when the DNA bases are complementary on both strands. The more DNA bases which hybridize, the more alike the DNA is. The new strands are then heated to separate them. Since similar DNA will have more hydrogen bonds between the strands, a higher temperature will be required to break them apart. Therefore, the higher the temperature needed, the more similar the DNA of the two species are. Comparing amino acid sequences. Proteins are made by amino acids. The sequence of amino acids in protein is coded for by the base of sequences in DNA. Related organisms have similar DNA sequences. Therefore, they will have similar amino acid sequences in their proteins. Immunological comparisons. This is a method of using antibodies to determine how similar two proteins are. Antibodies bind to proteins in a specific manner, so similar proteins will bind to the same antibodies. Serum containing albumin is extracted from species A. This serum is then injected into species B, and antibodies are produced. This serum, now containing specific antibodies, is then extracted. Serum is also extracted from a third species, species C and it is combined with the serum of species B. If species B's antibodies complement and attach to species C's antigens, then a precipitate is formed. More precipitate means that the species are more similar. And that's all. Thanks for watching.